Harbor. No. Hey, welcome back to you, me, and the movies. Tonight we got a special request. Special request. Granny, granddaddy, Christine Patrick. Coming in hot. What are we watching? Euro trip. Sweet. Christy is apologizing for Patrick's pick last night. I appreciate with, uh, that. <laughs> from beyond. I appreciate so that. So now we're going beyond the ocean to go on a Euro trip during our spring break week here at You Mean Movies. Just watched Van Wilder, and now we're going to watch Euro trip. I think lots of schools have already gone on spring break. Oh, well, yeah. Well, whoop de doo. All right. Well, it's not even, it's barely spring. It's true. Spring just now it's happened. Spring break. Yeah. All right. So, Euro trip. All right. Yeah, from the producers of Road Trip and Old School. Nice. Yeah. It's got Michelle Trattenberg in it. Cool. From Harriet the Spy. Yeah, or Pete and Pete. Okay. That's where I first saw her. Sweet. Yeah, and Tim from your favorite show right now, Justified. Ah, Tim. Young Tim. Oh, young Tim. Yeah. Okay. He's the guy with the long hair on the cover. Oh, that'll be interesting. Yeah, you get to see... Kind of, this is what I think probably kind of put him on the map a little bit as an actor. Oh, definitely. One of his big reels. Cool. Yeah. All right. Well, should we go on a trip and head on over to Europe? Let's do it. Let's do it. But first, like, comment, subscribe, come hang out with us for Euro Trip. And if you want to be like Christine Patrick. Yeah, and get your own special request. Check out our Patreon link down below. You might be able to snag one of those special requests. Lots of you also get early access, full encounter, and access to polls up to our sex. Links down there. Check it out. Let's watch Euro Trip Unrated. Oh, here we go. The belt clipping. Didn't like the way it sounded inside my brain. <laughs> I got new headphones, if anyone's interested. They're bone conduction. We're trying them out. It's, it's conducting in my bones. Technology of the 21st century. It's crazy. I'm probably talking a lot less loud, too. What? <laughs> I know. Are you going to be able to hear me? Oh. Oh, oh! I'm about to barf. <laughs> it's like Team America all over again. <laughs> Cartoons. <laughs> That's why I don't like sitting in the back. I see the back's my favorite, so maybe I'll have to rethink that. Actually. Congratulations, Hudson High class of 2004. I was already out of high school. I was still in high school. You're so young. <laughs> this was right in between us. <laughs> hey! <laughs> congratulations, graduate. Thanks, baby. And wow. congratulations to you, Cooper. Oh, thanks, baby. <laughs> nice All right. Someday he'll be a U.S. Marshal. Scott, we need to talk. Yeah, about what? About me dumping you. Uh oh. Smile, you too. <laughs> what do you mean you're dumping me? Scott, I just can't take all the lying and cheating on each other anymore. Stop. Sweetie, I never cheated on you. I know. That's what makes this so hard. <laughs> what a bitch. Here's your letter jacket back. Goodbye. This isn't mine. <laughs> She couldn't wait until after graduation to dump him. This was after graduation. I mean, like, after the day. <laughs> Mail, motherfucker! <laughs> this is Leon's voice. Leon. Was it? From Curb Your Enthusiasm. Did it sound like it to you? Yeah, it did sound like yeah. Leon. Was he on the show yet, though, at that point? I don't know. No, he moved in in Hurricane Katrina, so he was not on the show in 2004. Well, whatever. It still sounded like... It was still that <laughs> yeah. actor, oh, okay. right? <clears throat> What's his name? Gosh, I can't think of his name. You met a cool guy on the internet. Smooth? Okay, Smooth? Smooth. Smooth. Yeah. Smooth. Um, that's the American Pie Room. Let's go. I'm not going to let Fiona ruin my graduation night. Was it the American Pie Room? It kind of looked like it. Fiona talk. Look around. There's got to be a hundred drunk girls here, and we should be trying to have sex with every one of them. Hello? Mixed company? What? I'm a girl. 
No, you're not. Yeah, you're just a cool guy with long hair. <laughs> hey, Jamie. You fine form, I see. Mm. Why'd you get me gin and tonic? I hate gin. You do? You guys are the worst twins ever. And they don't have the twin thing going on? Apparently not. Paris. I can't wait. I heard two years ago, Nikki Jager's sister Debbie met this really wealthy French guy and they spent a month sailing the Mediterranean on his yacht. You're stuck on a boat with a weird French guy? <laughs> that sounds a little gay. It, it's not gay. I'm a girl. <laughs> kind of gay. No gay. <laughs> All right. I gotta piss like a pregnant woman. That's pretty bad. I'll play a little song for you. Matt Damon. About the nastiest... <laughs> <laughs> Freakiest little sex puppet I this know. This is his best role. Fiona. Oh, God. Oh, no. Well, this isn't the guy with the Letterman jacket. Happy anniversary. Oh. Happy anniversary? <laughs> like a month? How did he not know that she's been boning eight other guys? Every Sunday. <laughs> that's where this song's from? <laughs> oh, that's so embarrassing. Who needs more Chablis? Chablis? Well, there's I, your R rating right the there. boobs are perfectly played. Oh, they're there. <laughs> we'll go back to you, me and the boobies. <laughs> the first shot, the boobs were perfectly oh, placed right behind the camera, so I couldn't oh, see them at all. Park my car. I saw them. <laughs> I'm sure you did. You've got a little something on you. Where? That's her natural. Is it off? No, keep rubbing it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, it's the other one. No, it's just not coming off. Boy, it may be tree sap or something. Try pinching it. <sighs> no. Maybe they're not natural? Are they natural or are they fake? At this point, I don't care. If they're fake, they're very well done. No, it was like... Again. Yeah. I, I, I they're, need to moving. See more. they're moving. They're <laughs> moving. God. Is it off yet? Okay, fine. I'll do it. Come here. Oh my god, Candy! <gasps> Cooper! Hey, <laughs> this isn't where I parked my car. <laughs> <laughs> he even lip syncs at his live concerts. Right. Matt Damon. Man rocks! <laughs> <laughs> it's a really catchy tune. Where did he pee? Not in the toilet. Oh, gross. It kind of sounds like Dokes from... Uh, nah, it's definitely Smoot. But this was before Dokes on Dexter. Remember? Surprise, motherfucker! Yeah, no, it's definitely Smoot. Maybe I could come to America and we could get to know each other better. Perhaps we could arrange a meeting. I don't want to arrange any meetings with you. You sick German freak. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Looks like you after you wake up. I hardly drool anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you wearing my bathrobe? Oh, I'm sorry, but somebody pissed all over mine last night. <laughs> Oops. Wow. I can't believe this German chick wants to come here and hook up with you. Yeah, I don't think so, buddy. Mike's a guy. You sent me a picture, Ritardo. That's Jan, a man's name. And that's not Mike. It's Mika, a common German girl's name, similar to our Michelle. I hope you wrote her back and told her to come and visit. Oh no. No!
Thought he'd been talking to a dude this whole time, huh? Ugh. Fiona was having a threesome. Gross. Matt Damon. Well, Fiona, Fiona's a slut. We know that. But when you don't speak with me, then I will not speak with you. Oh no, blocked. I'm in love with Mike. Okay. <laughs> no. no, you idiot. Mike is a girl. No, no, no. I get it. Yeah. He's the girl, and you're the girl, and sometimes uh, you're both the girl. Right? <laughs> right? That's hot. <laughs> Wait, that's Mike? That's who you've been writing to all this time? Yeah, you know, until last night when I took your advice and told her to keep her hands off my genitals. Well, given what we know now, it seems like the exact opposite of what you want. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing I know is that she lives in Berlin. So go to Berlin. Yeah, how many Mikas could there be in Berlin? <laughs> I'm going to Germany. No, we're going to Germany. Germany's great. Euro trip! <laughs> I didn't go to Berlin, though. I went to Munich. But Munich. Munich was fun. I've never been across the Atlantic Ocean. I preferred the German countryside. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I don't have anything to Germany for a week. Uh, but I can get you both to London today for $118. Anything else? Europe is like the size of the Eastwood Mall. We can walk to Berlin from there. <laughs> $118? That's a steal. Do they still have that service? Courier service? Is that what they were doing? Yeah, they're they're taking the packages yeah. for cheap tickets. Yeah. Oh. Glad you're following the movie. You know America was founded by prudes. Prudes who left Europe because they hated all the kinky, steamy European sex that was going on. <laughs> He's not wrong. Damn right? Puritans. <laughs> oh, what is that? Uh, it's it's the phone they gave me at the law firm. Cooper here. Hello, Mr. Walters. Uh, yes, sir, I'm down in file storage. <laughs> no, sir, I can't find the Goodman file anywhere. Y yes, sir, I'll keep looking. No, I don't rest until I find it. <laughs> Didn't tell your boss you were leaving the country. They would have stopped paying me. Right. It seemed easier. <laughs> what do you want to... Wrong pub? This is a private member's bar. Exclusively for the supporters of the greatest football team in the world, Manchester United. Please enlighten me. Who the fuck are you? Man, you fans are crazy. If you're Manchester United supporters, sing the Manchester United song. I'm not much of a singer. Ah, sing! My baby takes the morning train. He works from nine to five. <laughs> Find me. Is that not the song? Ah, the best freaking team in all the land. Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! Pretty damn good, lads! Yeah! <laughs> Can you do that? No. Really? You can't? I mean, how's anyone supposed to know it's a members-only bar, you know? I was going to give myself to him. Perhaps you should give yourself to someone else. Third line. This is a bad dream he's having. Are you sure? This looks like a pretty nice dream. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Well, for that other guy. Yeah. Honey. Scotty. Cooper said they were going camping. Oh. Oh no. Nice. <laughs> Cooper <laughs> lied. Fuck if I know. <laughs> I don't even care where those little brother's at. Where are we going? You mean where are we going? We're gonna see the mighty reds through the frogs in Paris! And we yeah. boys! That's in the kind of right, right direction. direction. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta go through France to get to Germany, because that's where the tunnel goes through, right? Mm-hmm. Wow. 
You guys are on like a completely different level of swearing over here. <laughs> Mika's in Berlin. We're not going to Berlin. What are we gonna do? We need a plan. You get a free trip to Paris. It's gonna be way cheaper to get from Paris to Germany than Paris London to Germany. It's probably a suburb of Berlin. It's a nothing commute. This is why France and Germany have always been allies. Allies. <laughs> now they just gotta go east. In England, I'm driving on the wrong side of the road always. <laughs> They're still driving down. <laughs> that wanker's got a front football shirt on. Let's give this Nancy a fucking good kick in. Holy oh, shit. He's going off. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> he well, dropped his French baguette. See you later. <laughs> what is that, a new camera? This isn't just a camera, this is a Leica M7. Let me see that thing. No can do. Nobody touches my camera but me. So it's like your wiener. No, it's not like my... <laughs> 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 Guys, we're wasting the whole day here. We're in Paris. Let's go to the Louvre. To, to the Louvre! Louvre! No, you can definitely waste a whole day in the Louvre. It's huge. Oh. I don't remember having to stand in the line that long. Must be like the nude exhibit day or something. Must be. Here's a fun fact. Voltaire contracted syphilis just two blocks from here. Should we go? <sighs> Can we please just get out of here? This guy is really creeping me out. <laughs> it's because he's doing this. <laughs> I am familiar with over 600 dance moves and I am programmed to get Freaky. Probably have to be a license to to be a street performer in London. Or I mean Paris. He's moving in on his turf. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he pissed the robot off. <laughs> Careful, he's more machine than man. really committed to those characters. Error, error, error. <laughs> error, error. <laughs> he got him right in the nuts and bolts. <sighs> we are right here in Paris, and I have got to get to Mika, who is over here in Berlin. And Jamie, if you come with us, I'm sure there's a ton of great stuff that you can see. It's right along the way. The more the merrier. <laughs> What the hell is that? It's a traveler's money belt. Fromer says as long as you have one of these, no one can rob you of anything. Except your dignity. I was just no, gonna you say that. that in your... Wait, what? <laughs> huh? Check it out. European ass. What's up? Oh, Jesus, Jenny. I thought you were some... Girl, come on, platform four. <laughs> My name is Crystal. Jenny, let's go! Move it! Those are my friends. We're supposed to get on a train to Berlin. Yeah. I'm coming! <laughs> she could have been yachting all around the Mediterranean with that guy. Bummer. But he doesn't know that Fiona and me do it in my van on Sundays. Says some she's What? <laughs> you gotta admit, it's a really catchy tune. It really is. Scotty doesn't, doesn't know. know. Scotty doesn't know. You don't know? 
<laughs> Fred Armisen. <laughs> It's so weird. Big tunnel. Oh shit. <laughs> oh no. And he does that. <laughs> Just goes in with no pants on. What's there to see in this town? Uh, hello, the monument to Poissonnière. We're here to see Europe, not some crappy statue. Huh. Says here this town has a famous nude beach. All right, look, we can't all just lie around all day. We've got to get out there and experience the culture <laughs> firsthand. Let's go exploring. You ever been to a nude beach? No. Do you think you can go an hour without your currency colostomy back? Hey, hey, as long as this thing has our money and our passports in it, it's not coming off. Good choice. Three, two, one. Ha <laughs> ha, look at Jamie's penis. <laughs> <laughs> what dicks. Hello, oh, look at all those wieners. So many wieners. Settle down. All of the men are looking for the women, and none of the women are there. During the summer months, all the European women are chased away by gawking male tourists, so Europe's most nubile exhibitionists head to the deserted beach right next to the Monument de Poissonnière. <laughs> okay. There's all the boobies. That's why I'd go to the statue first. Let's make out? What? They're European girls. <laughs> hey. Oh no. Protect her. Hmm. At least the sun's out. No, 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 no. Holy crap. What? I thought this was a nude beach. Oh no. No! No, no, what? no, Jenny, Jenny, you gotta, you gotta cover up, cover up, cover up, cover up. Yeah, big mistake. <laughs> Somebody dropped their flip flops. Go without me. All right, see ya. All these men to take their pants off for a movie. They're European guys. They just run this around in, normal. with their dicks hanging out all the time? That's what nude beaches are, babe. They have nudity on network TV. Or Not so, got enough self confidence. Remember how America was. Created? The prudes, yeah. I know. I still, I still wave that prude flag, I guess. I'm so sad and lonely. Oh, no. Let us make love for one whole month. Good luck. Those are real. I love German boobs. Makes me think that the girls in the hot tub were fake. Look at this. 
Yeah. David Hasselhoff. The, the Hasselhoff. Hoff. Oh no! <laughs> he is a scary dude. How is he on the same train? Every time. Oh no. So many shenanigans gonna happen in Amsterdam. Have you been to Amsterdam? No. Oh. I have no interest in going to Amsterdam. Oh. Doesn't seem like my kind of town. You probably make a lot of money in the red light district. Weird. <laughs> I'm just saying you're beautiful. How's that weird? Are you calling me a, a whore? No. Saying I should whore myself out in Amsterdam? Weird. Just saying when in Amsterdam the red light district's hottest sex club we have to check it out who's with me i'll go fine since no one else is willing to go i'll just go myself <laughs> this is definitely where i parked my car <laughs> are we like tested for stds regularly Welcome like to club Vandersex, amsterdam's most erotic club to Lucy Lawless. A country where a man is forced to make sex to only one woman at a time, and one must learn the woman's name beforehand. It's horrible. <laughs> I know. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's wonderful. Mm -hmm. I love the sex. You're gonna enjoy these men. These are magical. You want to do this? Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, slow pace yourself. down. I'll pace yourself. Especially if it's your first time. Yeah, they're going to be tripping balls. Oh, they're going to feel like they're dying, probably. Is that a Leica M6? Actually, it's an M7. It's got the built-in light meter. You really know your cameras. I'm going on break. I was going to step out back and have a cigarette. Would you like to join me? I don't smoke. Neither do I. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. What is it? This is great. You're so innocent. Let's change that, shall we? Is she gonna rob him? Gosh, you really like cameras. <laughs> He's gonna have the most sex out of all of them. I know, right? Until we hear the safe word, we will not stop. Yeah, right. Stop. All right. On, on! Fun sex! Hans Gruber! Hans oh, Gruber! No! So, Did you are the read the safe word? Coming back? Administer the testicle clamps! Huh? What? What's your safe word? <laughs> I don't think you read safe it. <laughs> oh shit. What is that? That's not a word. That's a Flugen Kingen Kyan. Flugen Ow! Ow! Gimme cash, you got cash? Gimme cash. Oh, take it all, you dirty girl. What? Oh, I love you. I love you. I, lo oh, I love you. I love you. That's all of their stuff, though. Yeah. It's hot in here, you hot? Huh? I'm, I'm really hot. Okay, I can't breathe. Ugh. Nothing, nothing about pot seems fun to me. Nothing about it. I saw a gay porno once. I didn't know until halfway in. The girls never came. <laughs> You sold us a bad batch of hash brownies. You're a bad, bad Rastafarian. These are not ash brownies. We do not serve ash brownies here. We are simply Dutch bakery. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that's good. Now put your clothes back on, white boy. 
Just, just placebo. The placebo effect. They just are on a sugar rush. Did you say Yes, yes. For the love of God, Flugelheimler. What is she doing with that monkey? Oh, I love it when you do that to me. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Isn't What's the... happening there? Oh, God. Isn't that from uh, Top Secret? I don't know. Remember that? I don't remember. Oh, poor guy. What'd you do last night? I don't want to talk about it. He got a t-shirt. Hello. Hello. Nailed it. <laughs> Ich halte mich wach mit 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 Schnaps, äh, Benzedrin und diesen kleinen äh, Peanuts mit der Schokolade drumherum. I love chocolate covered peanuts. Berlin, hey, klar kann ich Berlin. Ich habe meine Alte abgestochen in den Bahn Berlin. <lacht> ich fahre so schnell nicht wieder nach Berlin. Ja, Berlin, Berlin. Mal zu, falls ich auch nur noch in die Nähe von Berlin kommen sollte. Ja, wenn oh, ich warte. In Berlin. <lacht> He's going to Berlin. Awesome. Oh no. <lacht> Bratislava. Oh shit. Oh shit. We're in Eastern Europe. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> Don't take his hand. We just get Miami Wise on television. Hey man, Miami Wise is number one new show. <laughs> <laughs> Like 15 years ago, 20 years ago. More than that, in the 80s, right? How much money do we have? Former's travel tip. Keep change in your shoes. It's Just American coins. American. What are we gonna get with that? I was gonna say, and I don't know where that country <laughs> is, but no way. Teraz bez trenie. It's just a commercial. Would the masters care for anything else? I think we're good. Thanks. Oh, a nickel. I quit. <laughs> I open my own hotel. Jeez, what is the exchange rate? Hopefully they bought tickets to Berlin with the exchange rate money. The Electro Euro remix. You are the woman from the Paris train station, aren't you? My name is Krista. What are you doing here? Well, this is my place. I'd be honored if you join me in my VIP room for a drink. Okay. What kind of man is he if he opens a nightclub in Bratislava? <laughs> yeah. My family has a yard in the Aegean. Come with me, Jenny. Spend the day sunbathing, drinking wine. My wife makes the best sangria. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> you just go around Europe sleeping with every woman you meet. No, please, Jennifer, it is not like that. I also sleep with men. <laughs> <laughs> he does not discriminate. <laughs> Why are they playing American music and Europeans have their own music? They wouldn't be playing American music. Maybe they requested it. Some jungle juice. No way. Jamie's hooking up with another girl. God damn it. It's just so unfair. I've been all over the place looking for crazy European sex, and he's the one who ends up getting. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, that can't be. Oh, God. Stop them. <laughs> God. Yeah, I mean, how do you come back from that? They didn't mean to. It doesn't change the fact that it happened. <laughs> <laughs> he thinks 
It's hilarious. Jamie, can I borrow your Fromers? Oh, here's a fun fact. You made out with your sister, man! Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! Shut up. <laughs> My friends, where is the beef? <laughs> you go to Berlin, I'm your right. Nice, Duke's a hazard style. <laughs> That's funny. Really is a fan of America. <laughs> they must have gave that guy enough money to buy that car, huh? This is Mika's apartment building. Wish me all sorts of luck, guys. Or it's Jan's. This is, it's her cousin. Wasn't it Jan? <laughs> yeah. My daughter had intended to spend the summer in America looking at colleges and visiting some friends. But uh, several days ago, she suddenly changed her mind. I think I know why. Uh, this is Heinrich. He's Mika's stepbrother. Uh, as I was saying, she packed up her bag. What? <laughs> <laughs> in the classics, Greek and Roman literature. Oh, shit. <laughs> interest. Well, do you know where she is? Mm. <laughs> Uh, she enrolled in a summer Keep your eye on that kid. Mika's tour group goes to the Vatican tomorrow, then she Oh, she's in Italy. I'll walk or I'll hitchhike. I'll swim if I have to, but I'm gonna get to Mika somehow. You're gonna wanna fly. It's gonna be much more more efficient. Maybe that'll help. Sold his camera. We're going to Rome. Yeah, you're going to need to keep your distance for a while. <laughs> <laughs> Might never be able to hug again. <laughs> oh, but we are a private tour group. We've come all the way from America. That guy in the orange jacket is mentally retarded. Oh, oh. see, I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> but if you are a tour, where is your guide? We've got a fantastic tour guide. Right here. Ah. What? No. The Vatican has been used as a papal residence ever since the time of Emperor Constantine the Great in the 5th century AD. Vara avant. Okay. Um, if you'll all follow me, please. <laughs> Free tour. Have a very special day for a very special little man. <laughs> One of our English-speaking tour guides is called in sick. Could you please take these people's also? How big is Vatican City? 0.5 square kilometers. Good thing he memorized that. Fromer's guy, yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, miss, what is this? Ah, oh, that is the bell of San Marco. When the Pope dies, the Cardinal Vicar of Rome rings this bell to notify the people of Rome. Next, we will view the Sistine Chapel. Follow me. Oh, Sistine Chapels. Amazing. For me. Hey, check it out. I wonder what this does. It doesn't do anything. It's a rope. Come on, let's go. They got a lot of old stuff here. Oh, no. The bell of San Marco. The Pope is dead. Oh, well, starting an international crisis. Let's go. We're definitely not supposed to be in here. Hey, check this out. I'm the Pope. Oh, God. The hat. The hat is on fire. Uh, we don't need no water. Let the mother... I'm not... <laughs> Go. Go. Oh. oh, no. Smoke. White smoke. <laughs> Shit. White smoke. They've elected the new Pope. That was quick. Oh, God. Golly. So uncomfortable for me. <laughs> Mika! It's the new phone! <laughs> he's young too. He's gonna be serving for a long time. And he's not Catholic, so that's impressive. Well, not all the popes are Catholic. Really? Yeah. 
That doesn't make any sense. Mika! Hold on! This is one crazy fool. <laughs> you and your retarded friend. You're a big, big trouble. Oi! Take your mitts off them boys! They're with me! <laughs> Who are you? Ooh. I'm Scott. From Ohio. Scott? Listen, I just traveled all the way across Europe. I, I, got, I got chased by naked men. I watched a brother and sister make out. <laughs> Gonna consummate that popage. Oh, jeez. There's two birds with one stone. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. I have cheated on my husband. Do you think God will ever forgive me? Oh, yes. Father? I'm pretty appalled by that, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I still can't believe you came all the way here. Just for me. What can I say? I'm very unpredictable. Keep writing to me, Scott, okay? You gotta unblock him first. They're gonna end up going to college together. Mm. Getting married. Spend the rest of their life together. Or never seeing each other again. Because yeah. they live on know. two different continents. You were the most knowledgeable, albeit idiosyncratic tour guide I've ever had. <laughs> Thanks. But I'm not actually a tour guide. Um, I've just read Fromer's enough to have it memorized. Is he Fromer? Excuse me? That's my guide. <laughs> <laughs> He's Fromer! It's amazing! <laughs> Fromers is going to pay me to see every museum and cathedral in Europe. That's amazing, actually. I figure since you're going to be staying, you might need this. A disposable camera. That's right. Thanks, Scotty. That's from both of us. <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> Fired? Well, I... If, well, if that's what you want, I understand. I just... Goodbye, sir. They had to catch you eventually, right? No, they fired Humphrey. Shut up! <laughs> yeah, I got his office in a raise. No. <laughs> They're over it. They're gonna have sex in that bathroom. It's still your Europe airspace over international waters. So this still counts as Europe, right? Three months later. Do they room all you pre-med geeks together? I'm not sure. I'm going pre-med. Thinking about majoring in German. So how's Jenny? Jenny, Jenny who? I know a lot of ladies named Jenny. They're all in. My Ow. <laughs> Oh, hold on. This could be my new roommate. Hey. -o. What's the freak look like? Are they rooming together? You're going to college here? What dorm? This one. Room 214. Oh, now they're living together? How is this possible? I guess they thought I was a guy. <laughs> Mike. Would you dumb enough to make a mistake like that? <laughs> It's just meant to be. Mm. Living together at 18. That's your tune. Fucking A. Scotty doesn't know. Scotty doesn't know. Hello. And welcome. 
Welcome to Amsterdam's finest and most luxurious youth hostel. So I dream a genie? I don't know. <laughs> if you do not wish to have your valuables stolen, I suggest destroying them or discarding them right now. <laughs> you can also try hiding your valuables in your anus. <laughs> You take her hair, and one strand at a time, pull it out. <laughs> Move her like a humping dog. <laughs> Should a fire occur due to a faulty wiring or uh, the fireworks factory upstairs, you will be incinerated along with the valuables that you have hidden in your anus. This <laughs> 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 is because he's wearing full clothes in there. Piss off! Get in here and say that, mate! Come on! <laughs> fucking come and have it! You fucking bitch! <laughs> God out of it! Fuck off! I'm knackered! <laughs> like... Take a breath. <laughs> How'd that work? I'll show you later. Oh, okay. Thanks, honey. Well then. I totally forgot Matt Damon was in this. Matt Damon. I didn't know he was in the band Lustra. The band what? Lustra. Lustra. Huh? Mm, performed by Lustra. Oh, these actually hurt the side of my head. Oh. It's unfortunate. Bummer. Power up. Did they sound good? Sound fine. Better or worse? The same. Okay. All right. Euro trip. Sweet. I want to go to Europe now. Do you? Yeah. Well, someday. I want to make the same exact trip they did. No, we don't. No, you don't. You don't want to do that. Why not? Oh, like we can skip the, the that one nude beach unless it's not summer. Yeah. Well, I mean, you're not. A like a teenager anymore. What's that supposed to mean? Wouldn't be as exciting, I'm sure. So it's as exciting as you make it. That's the moral of the story. The moral of the story is just go to Europe to have sex, right? And be unpredictable and make it exciting. Mm. Right? Mm. You never know what opportunities will pop up. In Europe? Yeah. You think Fromer's going to be hanging out? <laughs> one guy got a job. The other one found the love of his life. And then two friends didn't even realize they were meant for each other. Discovered mm. their true love. It is really just a love story after all. Yeah. They all got what they love in the end. So sweet. Yeah. What was the funniest part for you? I honestly don't know. What was it for you? Muscoozy, Muscoozy. Oh, God. Fred yeah, Armisen. Fred Armisen. <laughs> <laughs> that or the robot fight. That's a pretty good one, too. Yeah, yeah. And Scotty doesn't know. That's a very good song. And I'd heard this song before. And yeah, it's catchy. Know. Everybody was singing this for the next three years after this movie came out. Yeah, I didn't uh, know that this is what it was from. Especially if you have a friend named Scott. Yeah. <laughs> You're singing it to him all the time. Yeah. So, it's good stuff. Yeah. What do you think of uh, Tim? Oh, yeah, I did fine. I'm just fine. They had a few reshoots there at the end. Yeah. You could tell he was wearing a wig. but He was? Maybe just for the reshoots. Yeah. Just... There's a few scenes there at the end that you could tell that were reshoots they yeah, put in. Put them in the way. Mm -hmm. You could see, like, he's kind of funny on Justified. You can see his yeah, yeah. Humor in this, he's so. really gut dry. Yeah. He's so dry in, yeah, humor, right? in so, Justified. I like him. I like him. So, yeah. Where's this rank in your raunchy comedy, sex comedies? Um. American Pie. It's not as good as American Pie 
one. It's definitely better than American Pie 3. <laughs> American Wedding? Yeah. Okay. But it's maybe not as good as American Pie. It's definitely not as good as American Pie. It's somewhere right around American Pie 2. Okay. I mean, can you remember a song from American Pie? No. There you go. Eurotrip's got a got a one up there. There you go. All right. Well, what should people comment on after Eurotrip? Uh, what's your favorite part about this movie? Yeah, Aaron? it's the funniest part of your trip for you. Mm -hmm. And if you were going to take a Euro trip, where would you go? Yeah. What European country are you shooting for? Bratislava. we got nice nightclubs there. It's Bratislava? There's probably a Bratislava, too. Yeah, probably. So, Lots of Slavas over yeah, there. A lot of Slavas. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know all your fun, <laughs> fun Euro trip ideas. Yeah. Right? Thanks so much for hanging out, and thank you to Christy and Patrick. Mostly Christy for picking this one for me. Yeah. Very much appreciate it. All the dicks. She so many those. penises. <laughs> yeah. I didn't mind the boobs. I'm not going to say that I really enjoyed the penises, but it's nice. It's nice to see one on the screen because you don't. In, Usually. We don't see them very frequently. Yeah. They always see boobs. It's a European never, thing. Never I mean, if you watch more European movies, you probably see a lot more dick. I well, we should do that more often, I guess. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just to even the scale a little. Oh, yeah. Balance it out. Even the scale. Balance the scale a little. Like... It's always like very female nudity heavy. Yeah. Well, it's only fair that somebody, you know, whips out the wang every once in a while. Female nudity is just so much more attractive than a wee. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't argue with you that on that one. <laughs> right? If you want to be like Christy Patrick, get your own special request. Check out our Patreon link down below. You also get early access, fully comedy access, to pull us up to pick up our snacks. Links down there. Check it out. Till next time, have a good one. Bye. Mascuzzi, mascuzzi. Oh, mascuzzi.